Right now for the population that we're raising money for, it really doesn't have an impact. There is an affordable housing crisis and it doesn't change, it remains the same. Resolve is a long-term solution and so it's difficult in, in the city right now when it comes to raising donations and there's some real big campaigns that are, that are coming ahead and they're serving many different needs in the city. Um, for Resolve in particular, I think it's just going to take longer to be able to receive the donations. The oil and gas prices are certainly affecting corporations and individuals, so it, I don't think it's that the priority of the campaign is different. I think it may just be the time frame. Resolve is really making sure that we are close to our people that we talk to, that our relationships are really strong. That's the most important thing right now, is making sure that the momentum of the importance of the campaign within the city um, maintains itself over this time frame. I think truly our activity is the point where we'll make our goal. It just might take a little longer to get there. I think Calgarians are seeing that there's a real need. We can't put that to the wayside. Donors are really getting engaged and understand the value in solving the problem and giving people a place to live. The vulnerable challenges don't go away, so finding solutions in this campaign is a solution. Between 2008 and 2011, the government invested money in affordable housing, and so by the city contributing and the community contributing the philanthropic part, um, seeing that affordable housing being built in the city and relieving some of the pressures on the city taxpayers is going to make a real difference. Calgary is a real can-do city. Um, it's only here that leaders in the community and the community can come together and put together a collaborative campaign like this, the first of its kind across Canada. We really are in it together.